the very genesis of this mount, found, uh, manifesto, is the foundations of this manifesto were built on the comments, the inputs, the anxieties, the concerns that were raised by people in these very rural communities about what they want to see happen in their country. Like everybody else, they aspire to something better. Those who live in urban areas also have similar aspirations. And I think the fact that, again, His Excellency President Mahama had the foresight to say, we will initiate a process of consultation across the country. So when he had his speak out tours, he had the opportunity to sit, listen, and understand concerns of people in our rural communities. And that gives this manifesto a very distinct uh, uh, flavor to the kinds of interventions that we have put forward because they are rooted in the concerns that people have raised. And I think, again, going back to those communities to say, you spoke, we have listened, we have heard, and therefore what we are proposing to do when you give us the mandate is a reflection of the things that you want to have addressed. That is what distinguishes the National Democratic Congress from other parties.